Curator is full of rules and settings and components that allows it to basically out of the box uh, provide a lot of uh, value to the organizations that use it. But why why is it that what happened when, when I want to customize it to something that is very specific to my environment? So in this particular case, what we actually want to show is a cost is actually a real case of a customer who wanted to detect when a user is actually at the same time or within the same reasonable period of time is is connected to the VPN, meaning he's remotely accessing the network and he is batch in, so he's physically in one of the locations at the actual uh, the actual premise. That should not be happening. Most likely, the guy coming from the VPN is a hacker, so they wanted to detect that particular situation. So here in the in the uh, on the log sources, the, in here you will find you will have the the log sources that are you know the the DSM the the parsers that we support. But in here you will put the ones that you actually built. So let me show you an example of the two that has been built in here for this for this particular case. One is a, a physical batch reader, and what we have in here is the definition of it and this is just basically regular expression that allows uh, curator to actually select the fields that the customer is interested in having normalized and being processed and being part of the rules uh, and uh, this is one example let's see the other example and um, that's the the VPN and here's the regular expression for the VPN. So right now you need to know regular expression to actually do this work and don't be surprised if pretty soon Curator actually uh, permits uh, to do this by you highlighting the fields that you are interested in and it will drive, uh, derive the, the actual reg regex for you. But for now you need to uh, uh, get uh, this done or get somebody that does this like a service organization uh, to create those parses for you. But once th those are created, then that data actually uh, flows uh, into Curator and gets actually normalized. So what we are actually going to do is that we're going to play back uh, a, a set of events that actually represents the, the simultaneous access uh, to the VPN as well as the batch system. So by using the, I mean actually right click on any of the IPs, go to more options and the plugin and we have here that uh, we're, we're playing those uh, those logs and actually we just saw them come in here and these are basically the events that that has just been triggered as a consequence of that an offense is going to fire on the occurrence of those of those events so if we go to the offenses tab we can actually see uh, that event actually triggering an offense and here it is insider thread batch and VPN and once we have those parsers in these are only events because there are no flows coming from those uh, log sources what we need to do is as we always do display the rules that actually made that offense fire and this is the offense we created for that and it basically reads that if you get access to the VPN and the batch within one minute and it's the same user ID, uh, then fire that offense.